Good evening. As eligible New Mexicans start getting COVID booster shots, we're getting a better look now at how the state plans to roll out those shots. News 13's Annalisa Pardo talked to the state. She's here this evening with details. Annalisa. Well, during its peak back in June, the state was administering about 20,000 shots a day. That's down to a trickle, and mass vaccination sites are closed down. While we might not see as many clinics or partners helping as before, the state is working to bring back help for booster shots. Given the need to distribute vaccine boosters to what will likely be most of the state, um, we obviously want to bring back as much of that infrastructure as we can. The state says it's finalizing a contract now with an outside party to help open vaccination sites and create mobile teams to administer boosters. Details on how many vaccine sites and when they'll be up and running are not finalized yet. The state says it's also relying on health care providers and pharmacies to give out shots. The state surveyed thousands of vaccinated New Mexicans and 90% of them say they plan to get a booster shot when eligible. Based on that data, we think the demand is going to be quite strong, that uh, folks, especially in this early phase. Right now, only certain people who received Pfizer vaccines are eligible for booster shots. The FDA is currently considering a half dose of Moderna for a booster shot. New Mexico Department of Health is not recommending people who got Moderna to then switch over to Pfizer shots since the FDA and CDC have not approved that. Back to you. Annalisa, thank you. The state says it has data now on how many New Mexicans got each vaccine and will track those booster shots. It's still deciding whether it will display that information on the public dashboard. Well, nearly all